Peace, black family. Now, the verdict has been in in the Dante Wright case. You see, I I wanted to make a video right after the verdict was announced. Well, not the verdict, but the sentencing, excuse me, after the sentencing has been announced. But I had to wait to get my emotions together because I was upset after hearing this judge, Judge Chu, or whatever her name is, give this murderous cop, Kim Porter, 24 months in prison for killing Dante Wright. And see, they charged her with manslaughter. She should have been charged with first degree murder because she intended to kill him. Lying, talking about she um, thought it was her taser. And she's been a cop longer than Dante Wright has been living on this earth. And see, family, that's why I tell you guys, do not get excited. And believe that it's a victory when we get these guilty convictions. Because racism and white supremacy always come out with a trick bag. And see, the family, they, they testified and they were steadfast and being clear that they wanted Kim Porter to get the maximum of seven years in prison. But see, this was a trial by judge. And this judge completely disobeyed with the family's wishes and gave Kim Porter two years in prison. But see, but let me not, let me be more real because this is the United States. There's a shadow government. We could save that conversation for another day, but there's a shadow government. That the elected officials that we see have to adhere to. And this judge, she read her decision off a script. See, she knew what, what the verdict was all this time. And she read her little script, playing her little judge role that her handlers prepared for her. See, I wanted real justice for Dante Wright and his family. And I wanted to send a president that black people, we getting tired of this. We getting tired of being killed for driving while black or just existing. And see, now there's another story out of another black man being killed in Houston, Texas in a drive-by style so they can get his organs just like they took Don Dante Wright organs and, this, and every other uh, black see they organ harvesting and every, I get off subject and stuff too because there's other purposes that they do this to us Keep showing black death and black trauma. See, they gave her 24 months in prison with 57 days time served. They might as well not even gave her anything. And her defense attorneys had the nerve to be shooting for Probation. They really wanted her to get off with probation. And I'm telling you, we tried protesting. We tried petitions. We tried voting. We tried sit-ins. And none of that is working. This system is telling 
melanated people, the aboriginal people of the Americas, a.k.a. black African-American, that they're trying to annihilate us and that our lives don't matter. And they don't give a F about us whining and complaining about how unjust the system is. Now this woman, she's going to go ahead, this murderous cop, Kim Porter, she's going to go ahead and serve her time. And go back to her family and go back to living her life. But we have Dante Wright's family who has been completely destroyed by the pain of death of their loved one. From a murderous, fat, Mrs. Poppins looking bitch, Kim Porter. Now, I'm going to cut this video short. I didn't say what I had to say. Your family, leave a comment in the comment section below and let me know your black opinion on this topic. Peace, family.